Hi, in this video tutorial I will show you how to master page numbering in Word document. As you can see here, the first two pages have page number 1 and 2. The third page doesn't have page number. Fourth and fifth have alphabetic page numbering format that starts at C. The last page doesn't have page number. First off, from Home ribbon, under Paragraph Group, click on Show Hidden Marks. This will help us to see the end of sections. Chapter 1 and 1.2, they belong to the same section. So at the end of Chapter 1.2, I need to add Section Break. The way to do it, by going to Page Layout ribbon. Under Page Setup Group, expand Breaks option. And from Section Breaks, select Next Page, so that a new section will be created at the next page. Section Break defined by this dotted line. You can place it wherever you want. Section Break will add a new line, so you need to remove unwanted line, like this. If you double click the header or footer, you can see the section number. The first two pages belong to the same section, section 1, and section 2 for the rest of the pages. What we need to do now for the third page is to have a section for this page only. The same process here. At the end of the page, go to Layout Ribbon, Breaks, Section Breaks, Next page, and I'll delete unwanted line. Chapter 2 and 2.1 belong to the same section, so at the end of chapter 2.1, do the same steps for adding section break. Layout, breaks, section breaks, next page. That's it for the section breaks. Double click the footer. As you can see, we've created section breaks correctly. Next, we have to unlink the sections by going to Design Ribbon under Navigation Group, deactivate Link to Previous. Do this at the start of each section. We don't need to see the hidden marks anymore, so let's hide them. That's it. We've created unlinked sections. Finally, let's add page number. Click the footer section you want to add page number for it, and go to Insert Ribbon. Under Header and Footer Group, click Page Number. Click Format Page Numbers. Here you can select number format. And from where to start, by default it will continue from previous section. But we already unlinked the sections, so each section will always start from 1. Click OK. Click page number again, and select where you want to insert it. I'll place it at the bottom of the page. That's it for the section 1. Section 2 is just a blank page, so ignore it. And let's go to section 3. Click the footer 
of the section 3 insert page number format page numbers this time I'll change number format to alphabetic and page numbering will start at C click OK now let's place page number at the bottom of the page that's it for the section 3 section 4 is just the end blank page that's all I hope it was easy to follow and helpful thanks for watching